I bet the Black Wolf founders would shit cats if they saw today's student body walking around like zombies on their phones. This is a great image. All those rippling green coins. I hope everybody got their wish. This day has been so insane. Everything is happening too fast. And none of it makes any sense. These visions, this power. I keep expecting to wake up one more time. But if this is a dream, then I'm not asleep. Which means somehow I did rewind time. So there has to be a reason. And I have to find out why. Miss Grant sure is dedicated to that petition. Hi, Miss Grant. Excuse me, Max. I know everybody loves being asked to sign a petition, but would you do Miss Grant a favor and hear me out? Sure, I always have time for you. What's the petition? David Madsen, our chief of security, wants to put surveillance cameras all around the campus. Halls, classrooms, gym, dorm rooms, etc. Blackwell Academy should be a high school, not a high security penitentiary. That's crazy. I get why school should be on high alert these days, but cameras in the dorm rooms. It's a slippery slope, and it's up to you and your classmates to stand up here. Blackwell Academy has a noble heritage, from the Native Americans who founded this land to the pioneers who shared it in peace, not fear and violence. The Native Americans? The tribes who were here first, who welcomed the settlers. Both cultures found a mutual symbiosis and thrived. Now, before I assign you homework with this lecture, will you please sign the petition to keep our campus from going back to 1984? Absolutely. I don't mind security, but not pure surveillance. I knew you were my favorite new student at Blackwell for a good reason. Mr. Jefferson has such a gift for different styles. That's one of his famous shots. I love how it captures the moment. Daniel is always drawing something. He makes me look like an extrovert. What's up, Daniel? Oh, hi, Max. Could I, um, ask you a question? Would you mind letting me sketch you? I do put my sketches on Facebook, though. I'd be honored, Daniel. Makes me feel like a muse. Funny you should say that. I was just thinking about my real muse, Rachel Amber.
So what happened to her? There's got to be a story. She just stopped coming to class. Some people said she ran away. Some say she jumped off a cliff. I just hope she's okay. You knew her? No, but once she asked me to draw her portrait. Oh, she was a natural. Hard to avoid her posters all over campus. Kills me to see her sweet face used as a crime photo. Ah, she had a good heart. Okay, why don't you start drawing me? Even though I must be a step down from Rachel. No way, you're a good substitute, Miss. Oh, that's a good posture. Good, good. Best portrait ever. There's Justin and his skater posse. They're so cute doing their tricks. Yo, Justin. Check out the Max. Come to thrash? Oh, yeah? Bring it. What's your first move gonna be? Uh, jump? You're such a poser. If you can't even name a simple nose slide or a tray flip, you should walk on. We're done talking. You're too sketchy. I've never seen so many missing persons posters for the same person. I could go for a burger now. Clever. That's Luke Parker. Zachary pushed him into a locker last week. Go bullies. Uh, hello? Max, I don't feel like talking. What's wrong? Nathan Prescott, little rich bitch kid. He thinks he can own people like his parents own Blackwell. Like he owns the Vortex Club. Yes, he's a nasty piece of work. Somebody needs to take that prick down. It'll happen. Karma doesn't play favorites. Yeah, history always proves that, right? Just wait for justice, you sheeple. I need to go there and grab Warren's flash drive. Evan's portfolio always looks so uber pro. I'd love to see his photos in there. I think his name is Evan. He always looks so intense. Hey, Evan. Mind if I check out your cool portfolio? Let's see if you're worthy of it, Max. You'll have to answer a simple question. Who photographed the famous falling soldier? Isn't it Robert Dorno? Oh my, you can't even tell the difference between street photography and photojournalism. No portfolio peak for you. Sorry, I have to get back to my portfolio. No time for amateurs. No offense, Max. Come on, 
Logan, bring it, brah. Yeah. I need to go to my room and return Warren's flash drive. The Prescott Dormitory? Good lord, Nathan's family owns my dorm? No. I always get a little giddy when I think about having my own room here. Yeah. Hey, Logan Robertson. All-American asshole. No, bro. You can't take a picture. You gotta wait till Friday's game. Awesome. Warren told me that totem is named Tabanga for a reason nobody knows. Glad to see our campus is eco-friendly. Nice, bro. There's Kate, looking sadder than usual. Hi, Kate. Hey, Max. How did you like class today? I don't remember. I guess I don't care about much of anything today. Is there anything... Sweet. Max, I'd like to be alone, if you don't mind. I'm sorry. Nice, bro. Good old Samuel. Some people are creeped out by him. He's not creepy, just X-Files weird. Howdy, Samuel. Well, hello there. Sweet. What's up with these Rachel Amber posters? Well, only she would know that, right? Uh, I guess. It just makes the campus look sad. You can't color over that sunlight. What was she like? She must have been popular. Even sunlight can cast shadows. Rachel did both at once, you know. She was like a battery. Positive and negative. You knew Rachel? How can you know a prism? You just stare in awe. Now I have to go paint windows. What do you think happened to her? Best not to dwell on the past. Samuel looks forward, like a clock. See you later, Samuel. And watch your step around here, Max. Awesome. After I sweep, I paint. Zachary always looks like he'd rather be throwing back a beer than a football. Football, Max. Big football. Step away. Yeah. Don't take it out on the tree, loser. I feel like Alyssa and I should be better friends. Oh. Hi, Max. What are you reading? Love today or die forever. Don't even say anything. It's a bestseller. What to say? Good point. Now if you'll excuse me. Yeah. Glad to see our campus is eco-friendly. With all these new droughts, it seems kind of obscene to waste all this water.
With all these new droughts, it seems kind of obscene to waste all this water. Here's Victoria and her mean girls. Oh, look, it's Max Caulfield, the selfie hoe of Blackwell. What a lame gimmick. Even Mark, Mr. Jefferson, falls for your wave hipster bullshit. The Daguerrean processor. You could barely even say that. I guess you got your meds filled. <laughs> Since you know all the answers, I guess you have to find another way into the dorm. We ain't moving. Oh, wait. Hold that pose. Dude. So original. Don't worry, Max. I'll put a vintage filter on it right before I post it all over social medias. Now, why don't you go fuck your selfie? Oh, yes, Victoria. I'll get your bony ass out of my way. I could crank the sprinkler up and give Victoria and her clones incentive to beat it. Nice, bro. There goes Samuel da Vinci to paint the window. This main sprinkler valve looks easy enough to use. This main sprinkler valve looks easy enough to use. missed something. I better rewind. Okay, let's see if this works. I don't want to mess with that ladder and hurt poor Samuel. I just want to get Victoria the hell out of the way. What the hell? Are you kidding? Look at this! Chill, Victoria. It's just water. Yeah, water on my cashmere. Do you know how much this fucking outfit costs? You look... Great. I can't even chill on the steps. No way! No fucking you okay, way! Okay, Victoria? Oh, Samuel, sorry. Wet, wet paint is not good for hair. Nope. Sorry. Get the hell away from me, weirdo. Hold on, hold on. We'll get some towels. We'll be right back. So move your ass before I dry. It worked. Don't mess with Max, bitches. Awesome. Uh, hey, Victoria. What do you want, Max? Don't. Don't say a word, Max. Oh, wait. Hold that pose. Nice. 
and no filter needed before I post this. No. Now please move. I've had a messed up day and I'm going to my room. You do that? I know where you live. So does Nathan. Maybe I shouldn't have done that. Now I have to... Blackwell isn't that big, but it sure feels like a labyrinth. Welcome to Black Hill. Room 217? No way in hell am I ever going in here. Go, Miss Grant. Not sure if I will, though. I'm a loser. I'd love to make a photo collage of every person who've posted these. Man, people here are merciless. Is this a Vortex Club or a Victoria Club initiation? Truly pathetic. Juliet, extreme reporter. Dane is still a cheerleader at heart. This girl must have been popular. She's everywhere. Nice atmospheric shot. Needs dusting. Looks like nobody won this TP war. There's nothing left but ghosts. At least that's an alarm from this century. We get it, she's missing. Somebody has gone crazy with these posters. Could be fun. Glad I'm not the only lonely nerd around here. Thanks for the warning. They live. Okay, this is just mean and stupid. The universal symbol for please leave me alone, asshole. This is like the public DNA of our dorm. How sad. I didn't write anything. I have nothing to say. Obvious, but true. But what's this poster really trying to tell me? Oh, Victoria, give me a fucking break. Warren should be all over Brooke. They're perfect for each other. Home sweet home. 
my favorite cocoon. Hard to believe I'm 18. Do I look any older? Just more stressed. Warren even left me a little message with his flash drive. He's such a goofball. Ahoy, Captain. At least I know you've got my back. When I swallowed your eye and my parents rushed me to the ER, I knew we were bonded forever. The Max Caulfield Photo Memorial Wall. So cheesy, but it makes me smile thinking of the day Mom and I sewed that together. <sighs> Max and Chloe, best friends forever. Who even says that anymore? I'm going to have to call Chloe eventually and find out what she'll say. The longer I wait, the worse it'll be. Idiot. I should hit the thrift store and pick up some dollar vinyl. Is that too hipster? I bet the Blackwell founders would shit cats if they saw today's student body walking around like zombies on their phones. This is a great image. All those rippling green coins. I hope everybody got their wish. This day has been so insane. Everything is happening too fast. And none of it makes any sense. These visions, this power. I keep expecting to wake up one more time. But if this is a dream, then I'm not asleep. Which means somehow I did rewind time. So there has to be a reason. And I have to find out why. Miss Grant sure is dedicated to that petition. Hi, Miss Grant. Excuse me, Max. I know everybody loves being asked to sign a petition, but would you do Miss Grant a favor and hear me out? Sure, I always have time for you. What's the petition? Hard to believe I'm 18 now. I'm lucky my parents enabled my photo habit into adulthood. It's not exactly pretty in pink, but no shits are given. I like my wardrobe. 
Would Man Ray call them selfie portraits? I love that mom sent me a fat box of chocolate coconut bites for my birthday and slipped in a $200 gift certificate. Hard to believe I'm 18 now. I'm lucky my parents enabled my photo habit into adulthood. Looks like Dana left me a little post-it note. Great, now I have to go get the flash drive from Dana's room. There's my poor laptop begging me to check in. I look so pathetic. Daniel has so much talent. I hope nobody hates on it just because it's me. I am so addicted to this site. Look at these vintage beauties. Warren makes me laugh. It's nice to feel like I already made a real friend here. It feels so nice to just relax. This day has been so damn bizarre and it feels like it has gone on forever. Maybe I'll just wake up now and find out I was dreaming all of this. Or like Poe said, a dream within a dream. You can't get out now, Dana. So tell me the truth or rot in there. Welcome to the real drama queens of Blackwell. Juliet looks like she's ready to throw down. You are ridiculous. Hey, Juliet, is everything cool? Oh, yes, Max. I've locked Dana in the room because we're cool. 
She's your friend. Friends don't sex with their best friend's boyfriend. No, probably not. How did you find out? Uh, why do you care? Why are you even asking me? You never talk. Just zone out with your camera. That's why I'm talking to you now. What's my last name? Juliet... Ju Juliet Olsen. That was truly sad. Thanks for your concern, Max Caulfield. By the way, Juliet Watson. Hey, Juliet. Is everything cool? Oh, yes, Max. I've locked Dana in the room because we're cool. She's your friend. Friends don't sex with their best friend's boyfriend. No, probably not. How did you find out? Uh, why do you care? Why are you even asking me? You never talk. Just zone out with your camera. That's why I'm talking to you now. What's my last name? Juliet Watson. Duh. I'm flattered. I didn't even think you knew my name at all. Of course I do. Just because I don't talk a lot doesn't mean I don't care. So, how did you find out about them? According to Victoria, Dana would do anything to date a quarterback. According to Victoria? Huh. She saw the sext, and Zachary won't answer his phone. Once Dana admits it, she can go. Straight to hell. Max, I swear I didn't do anything, but I bet Victoria did. I know the proof is in her room. Leave uh. me alone, Max. Get a clue. At least she puts her photographs out there, unlike me. She's actually got a classic medium format camera with some awesome prime lens. I hate you, Victoria. Whoa, I had no idea Victoria's parents owned the Chase space. Color me impressed. No, officer, I'm not snooping. Just admiring Victoria's cutting-edge tech. Is she going to get a 3D printer for her dorm room? Maybe I will join her posse. They should call this series aloof. Cold and soulless. Kind of like Victoria. Yes, I get it. Enter the Vortex Club. No. Okay, if I did wear expensive jewelry, I would wear this for sure. Victoria hates Rachel Amber this much? How insecure. Victoria is a real Jefferson groupie. I bet Victoria put Juliet on her shit list after this article. That is a tasty plasma. Maybe I could sneak in and watch Final Fantasy Spirits Within. I don't care what anybody says, that's one of the best sci-fi films ever made. Those boots are made for walking runways. Dior, Givenchy, you could pay for my tuition with that wardrobe.
Yes, Victoria has the best retina screen laptop. That's real nice, Victoria. And who the hell thinks I'm a hipster? Boom, this is the email I need to show Juliet. Now I have to print this fast and get the hell out of here. Victoria hates Rachel Amber this much? How insecure. This isn't even recycled paper. Victoria is not doing her part to save the earth, but this is for a good cause too. This better convince Juliet that Dana is innocent. Juliet, read this. Of course. I'm an asshole. I'm sorry, Dana. You are. And I hope so. You really think I'd mess around with Zachary? No, but I get stupid jealous. I owe you dinner. Still love me? And you do my laundry. Thanks, Max. You're like the Blackwell Ninja. Now let's see what Zack has to say about Victoria. You set me free. Thank you. Warren's flash drive is on my desk. Almost done. Get the flash drive and then I'll go see Warren. I can't even imagine what life would be like being a cheerleader. Dramatic, I guess. Dana takes her Blackwell spirit seriously. That looks like a home pregnancy test. Ooh, Dana's Facebook wall is up and running. I shouldn't look. There's that damn flash drive. Must protect my precious so Max never has to chase it down again. This is both sad and pathetic. Uh, Max, that's mine. Thank you. You're not helpful. You're just nosy. I think you better go. Nice, Max. You hurt her feelings by being so damn nosy again. But I could rewind and make it up There's to her. There's no more gossip for you here, Max. So go. I said, please go. Great. I made Dana even more stressed. There's no more gossip for you here, Max. So go. Max, enough.
I better make sure everything is still in there. I think Warren forgot to hide the party buster folder. Not that I would open it no matter how tempting. I have my self-respect. I better make sure everything is still in there. I think Warren forgot to hide the party buster folder. Not that I would open it no matter how tempting. I have my self-respect. You are dense. Go. I assume Dana kept the appointment. It would be a cool sticker without the words. This is both sad and pathetic. Good Lord, Dana really was on her own. Dana really does look stressed about all of this. Hey, Dana. Seriously, thanks again. I can't believe Juliet locked me in my own room. Real mature. Dana, I'm not trying to be nosy, but I heard a rumor about you. What? Who told you I was pregnant? Nobody important. They just acted like it was bullshit. I just wanted you to know. It's like a goddamn reality show around here. Can you keep a secret, Max? Of course. I was pregnant. Was. Oh. What about the other? That beat dad? You can catch him on the 40 yard line this Friday. And it's not Zachary. Who then? And you don't have to tell me. In fact, you better not. I like your spirit, Max. Anyway, you better get that flash drive so Warren has an excuse to bug you. Well, Max, that's mine. Thank you. You're not helpful. You're just nosy. I think you better go. Nice, Max. You hurt her feelings by being so damn nosy again. But I could rewind and make it up to her. I said, please go.
fuck this shit.